This morning, an NTSB hearing is underway to understand what went wrong in the catastrophic Norfolk Southern train derailment in East Palestine, Ohio, in February. One first responder detailing the chaos at the scene, testifying he didn't know the train was carrying toxic chemicals and his team did not have the proper equipment. It was dark, uh, the fire. There was no possible way to determine what uh, was you know on fire and what cars were derailed. Early on, it was determined a wheel bearing failed moments before 38 cars derailed and caught fire, releasing hazardous chemicals. Many residents were evacuated, but even after months of being back, many fear for their health. I feel like people that might want to get out can't get out. I feel that just people are afraid for their own safety. The hearing revealed concerns by the train's engineer about the size of the 150 car train, but those worries were allegedly ignored by the yard master who told him this is what they want. The hearing also focused on the toxic fumes ingested by residents and first responders. I'm concerned about not only my responders, but everybody around for long term health concerns. Hopefully we don't find anything. Uh, unfortunately, we probably will have some that will. Later today, the hearing will focus on safety measures along the tracks. It could take another year to finish the investigation. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.